Hey, I'm Jonathan Soul Sales at Mitchell Lincoln on the Boulevard and Enterprise, and I'm standing with this beautiful Infinite Black 2021 Lincoln Aviator Reserve, and we're gonna go inside, we're gonna go outside, we're gonna go all the way around and cover all the packages, all the features, and it's a beautiful vehicle, very luxurious, and I know that you will love it. So let's jump in. Getting started up front here, the beautiful Lincoln Signature Grill. So you see all the Lincoln stars in the grill outline and then right there in the middle. And of course the little camera right here in the bottom because this vehicle does have the 360 camera. So a uh, very nice feature to have. Also up front you have little sensors up front to help with parking, also those work with the Active Park Assist Plus that this one uh, has as part of your Copilot 360. This is a 201A. You also have LED lights up here, nice little projector beam and LED fog lights. And of course the beautiful turn signals right there. And um, then you have a little LED strip in there also that works for your Lincoln approach and Lincoln Embrace. Just very classy very nice addition to the lincoln lineup as we go around the side here we're upgraded to 22 inch wheels so these are the wheels that are standard on the 202a but they're optional on the other models so we have the 22 inch machined look and a very nice design a little bit of a twisted look which i like uh, also, this one does have the Copilot 360, as I mentioned already. So you do have the camera up top. So you have automatic emergency braking. Also have lane centering with the adaptive cruise uh, with stop and go. So once you engage that, it'll help keep you in the lane. And then lane departure every other time you're driving and some other uh, active features there and convenience items such as automatic high beams. Love the infinite black here with the... Uh, chrome accents really mesh really well together pops this uh, aviator emblem here just pops off the black really like it color keyed mirror caps the one thing that this car because of it being infinite black is missing compared to others is that floating roof design because you still have the a b c and d pillars that are blacked out on this vehicle like every other one but it's not as distinguished or the roof is not, uh, looks like that floating, but I love the, the chrome accents. It just kind of gives it a, a solid, um, like a mono color appearance, which is really nice. Continuing around here, you see more sensors on the back here, which will help uh, with proximity and the, uh, of course, the, uh, the parking as well. This one does have an optional uh, tow package. So you get that, uh, 5,000 pound tow capacity, hands-free lift gate. This one has the uh, 60 uh, or the six passengers with the mini console. So you can see that down there. So you easy to get back into the third row here and then a 50-50 split. And you can tell it also has the slate interior. So black with the slate, it's a good color combination. And of course, you everybody gets a headrest. So you have that option here. And right over the side here, just a one push fold, very nice. And you can hit it right in the middle to get both of them or do them individually like I just did. So that's a, a really nice feature for back here in the back. Underneath you have a little bit of storage and then your spare tire is accessed under this uh, panel here. This one also has your uh, Revel upgraded audio with the luxury package. So they have some speaker grates back there, some, some nice speaker panels. And I think the chrome is just right on this vehicle, really just uh, draws a little bit of attention, um, looks really good. But uh, 
you know, uh, the chrome roof rails, all those things. Have a turn signal indicator here. Also, of course, have uh, rear cross traffic with blind spot monitoring right there to notify you. And let's talk about some more of these uh, features inside. Okay, inside we're here and the luxury package, of course, offers the 30-way perfect position seating. So you have that right here with your adjustments for the, um, of course, all the different lumbar positions as well as the uh, bladder control, which would give you massaging seats and the thigh extension. So all this is right in here. Also have a three setting, three settings for your uh, memory seat. And as I mentioned, you also upgrade to that Revel uh, Ultima uh, upgrade with extra uh, speakers. Here's your big screen up top. And we'll just go ahead and fire this up here because it is rather warm today. So welcoming you to the aviator here. Big multi-information display right here, this LCD. And uh, all your information just lights up right there. You can scroll through some other uh, options here. Fuel economy right here on the steering wheel lights up right here. Scroll through that tire pressure. Go to a calm screen, which is really uh, limited information. And uh, of course you can see the uh, temperature here and the fuel 79 miles to empty. Here's how that big screen looks right here with uh, your home screen. So you can turn the audio on, add your phone or the uh, map. Of course you can touch into that and open it up. Big screen. Also you have the access of some apps or other audio here we'll turn that down because I don't own the rights to that music and just look how everything kind of runs together you have this trim piece that runs behind the floating screen look looks really good and uh, everything ties in well with this slate just have the black accents on the doors around the trim or around the uh, controls is really nice and we'll just scroll through real quick take a look from this angle and there's a couple more things I wanted to cover on the inside here. You notice these uh, nice uh, lights as well. They're open because the doors are open. You have your uh, shade and pano roof, which is part of the 201A package. And also this is something they started last year with an auto air refresh. So that also shows right here with this check mark. So it keeps things cycled and nice and fresh and clean. Sunglass holder right there. You also have your home link and vanity mirror right here. Also, this has the convenience package. So that's your uh, head up display. You can kind of see some of that information right here reflecting off of that um, windshield. I know it's kind of hard to see, but it's a, a very large display. You can see 40 miles per hour, 79 miles to empty. Um, kind of difficult to see in this camera. Also, that gives you a wireless charging pad, which is right here. Just slide your phone in there and it'll charge it. And then, of course, you can connect it, um, you know, to tether it for Apple CarPlay or what have you or wirelessly. Then you have the, your plug-ins right here, USB-C, USB, and can rest your phone in there and shut it down, whichever, the, whichever you prefer there. Piano key, gear changes right here with your instrument panel. Um, very convenient and a nice big console lid here so you can control your drive modes and flip back and forth which of course would show on the screen here we are in normal right now uh, light controls over here flip it to uh, on or, or running lights or leave it in auto and you also have a uh, fog light control and your rear power lift gate so you have all that stuff right here and what i love about this new steering wheel is it's lit up to what uh, controls are available so if I turn this on, you see how your other cruise and lane centering features and proximity distance there and all those are right back here to the touch. So as you have your fingers on the wheel, you can just control and touch those things. But if you don't have your cruise on, they're not lit up because there's no need to use those buttons. Same thing as you're going through here. All these light on or, or turn off. 
course, here's your uh, talk button or your voice control. Um, so it's just a, a great vehicle. Uh, a lot of uh, features on this reserve, heated and ventilated seats, heated steering wheel with the uh, elements package. So uh, a lot of good features and let's check out the back seat. I love this wide opening of the rear door. It's very easy just to come and slide right in, not really have to step up, don't have to step down, um, just, just right in. Plenty of good room. I had plenty of room up here, did not move the seat, and nice room back here. Nice little small console for some other uh, items that won't roll around, and then you can have cup holders, of course. And then you have your chargers back here, air control, and heated rear seats. So with the uh, elements package, really nice. And I did leave those, that third row folded down, I forgot, but uh, of course you uh, saw a peek of that earlier. Um, very comfortable back there as well. And you can, of course, these are on rails, these uh, seats here. So little bar release to slide up to give more room in that third row seat. So really nice. Also, um, one of the benefits back here of these electronic handles is that everybody gets their lock or unlock so you can kind of control that when necessary and of course can disengage the window and things like that from the drivers but uh, you can hit that lock or unlock to enable your uh, your doors door latches here so i think that's uh just about everything i know there's a lot more features uh, covered all the optional items on this uh, the sun shades is a nice touch for the, especially on a day like today that's very sunny and um, just a, a really nice vehicle. These are getting harder to come by uh, because of their popularity. They've been out, uh, let's see, about a year and a half now. So the 2020 models came out in late, uh, well, to, to us, in really late uh, 2019. And uh, then, then with all the uh, recent effects of the virus and uh, microchips and all those things. It's just getting harder to see these wonderful vehicles, but glad to have this one. Just also had a, a pristine white come in too. Uh, but because of that delay, I don't think I've, this is the first video I've done on a 2021. So great looking vehicle. Um, usually see the whites just because they're the most popular, one of the most popular colors, but love this infinite black as well. If you have any questions or comments, you can always drop them down below or call or text at 334-718-0504. I'm Jonathan Sewell Sales at Mitchell Lincoln on the Boulevard in Enterprise, Alabama. And I really can't wait to see you in a beautiful aviator or any one of these luxurious Lincolns.